Hello guys, welcome back to Mufasuket with AutoCAD 3D Modeling Practice Exercise number 11. And also don't forget to subscribe to our channel here, it will be helpful for us to growing up. Okay, in this uh, tutorial, I will create a 3D pot and you can learn how to use a uh, coated material like uh, this uh, plant object. And you can get uh, this uh, reference image from our Facebook page. Okay, we start now. Open your AutoCAD software and I will use a uh, front view. You can click here and change to the front view. I will create a line from here to the rack about 26. Okay, and enter again. Zoom out and I will create a line again from here to the right about 47. Enter and enter again. Okay, you can zoom out the drawing and I will move uh, the last object from here to the top about 100 okay next I will create a line from here to here okay use uh, offset command with a uh, distance about 3 click uh, this object and offset click uh, this object and inset click uh, this object and click uh, inset and enter next I will copy this uh, object to the bottom about 27 Okay, enter again and use a trim command to cut uh, here. Okay, in here, cut in here, and in here. Next, I will cut in here. Okay, and enter to finish. Use a fillet command with a uh, radius about 2. Okay, and tap M for a multiple object. You can click here and here and click here and here next we file it in here and we file it in here enter to finish and we file it again with radius about one click uh, this line and this uh, line okay use a join command to join uh, this all object okay you can click uh, this object and this object already join Next, we convert uh, this object into a 3D model by using a refurb command. Select uh, this object, click here to the top and click here and use a 360 degree. Okay, and we create a 3D pot here. I will go to the top view and I will create a circle from uh, this uh, center point with a radius about 3 and I will zoom in and create a circle again from uh, this center point with a radius about 2 and move on the last object from here to the top about 14 and then you shall uh, recommend we copy this uh, object by using a polar for the center point here and enter to finish we explode uh, this uh, array objects and ok and I will use the orbit command to rotate uh, this uh, object next we extrude uh, this uh, all object circle object extrude uh, to the bottom here and move uh, this uh, all object to the top here next we subtract uh, this object with uh, this uh, all object and enter ok change to the realistic view to view the object okay we create uh, this support and next I will change to the 2D wireframe and change to the top view I will create a plan shift click here plan shift can click from here to here and I will put the camera click here and here and lens about 90 okay and exit to finish I will change to the front view and I will move uh, this uh, object to the bottom here I will uh, copy uh, this object to the rack here okay and I will rotate uh, this object from here to here okay and uh, rotate again this object from here to here okay okay and then I will change to the top view move uh, this object to here 
and uh, rotate uh, this object from here to here okay and then move again this object to here and move uh, to the bottom here okay change to the front view I will put the plan soof the clear plan soof from here to here next I will change to the top view and I will uh, rotate the image we create a circle ok from uh, this uh, center point to here ok and then I will uh, convert uh, the circle into plan soof you can type a plan soof enter and type uh, O for object and select the object type L for the last object and enter and you can see we create a plan soof here and move uh, the last object ok from here you can click a continue to the bottom here about 5 ok ok and I will change to the front view again and change to the realistic view next we apply a material you can type air mode to open a material browser you can see here the global material right click and duplicate I will give the name about part ok and click here twice and give an image here I will put uh, this image open and bam I will use uh, this image and open and then I will use a thin here change the colors to here ok and close next I select uh, this uh, two object and right click in about material and assign to selection I will change the material scales you can click here image scales here into one ok and close I will create a material again you can right click here and duplicate and I will give the name is about plan ok click here twice and select the image I will use uh, this image open and I will use the uh, cutouts and select uh, this image and open and close and click uh, this uh, plan soup object right click here and assign to selection I will change the scale image here about oh, 250 ok and this cutout change to the 250 ok and then close and I will use a planner mapping here and select uh, this uh, plan soup enter and then you can move uh, this uh, triangle to here ok make it uh, bigger and ok and exit to close next I will move uh, this uh, plan soup to the bottom here and move again this plan soup to the right here ok I will create a material again duplicate and give the name about ground ok I click here twice click here image I will use uh, each image open and use the bum here bum you can select uh, this uh, image and open and then change uh, this uh, bum scales about 100 and then change the this image into 200 ok and close and close you can uh, rotate uh, the object and select uh, this uh, object right click here and assign to selection ok next I will change to the 2D wireframe and change to the top view I will uh, rotate uh, this uh, plan shift from uh, here rotate to here ok next we change custom models into camera here we change to the camera you also can change here to the realistic view and use the orbit command to rotate uh, the object here ok and I will save uh, this view you can tap uh, view ok create new here I will use here uh, 
new camera and then ok and ok change to the top view I will setting up uh, the plan so far and change here to the 3D wireframe I will move uh, this uh, plan so to here and move again to here ok and then we change the custom model views into new camera here and we try to render you can active the full shadow and render and fragment here active and use the custom background about white solid and white here okay okay and okay use the render to hike and we try to render okay we waiting for the rendering process until finish it about 10 level if you want to get uh, more quality about the final render you can change the level about 15 or 20 and the change of the size the image into the high resolution image okay we finish the rendering now if you have any question you can comment below this video and see you next time in AutoCAD 3D Modeling Practice Exercise number 12.